waiting for people, events, waiting for something better. It steals your memories. It steals your moments and the relationships that matter. One cadet was on one knee feeling the tombstone of a, a dead soldier, feeling the letters. And he looked up at me and he said, sir, the, this soldier was 18 years old. And he said, he's my age. And I said, yeah, you're right. And he wasn't worried about his Wi-Fi connection uh, for his uh, iPad. He was worried about getting out of the kill zone, and he didn't make it. The beauty of community and what it means to me. You see, the definition has changed entirely from what it used to be, and at the same time, hasn't changed a thing. To me, it simply means connecting to everything around me. And we have brought this to a new level of ability because it's not just the people down the street, but around the world I get to meet. And I tell you this, connecting with me in my community, a smile is all you really need. Because I've found no matter who it is, we all know a smile is happiness. And happiness is free. Oh my goodness. Look at this guy with all these tattoos. He's here and he's doing art. Who does he think he is? Let me tell you something. Uh, it's not the first time I've felt a little bit of discouragement entering into a situation. I'm sure everybody here, there's been times where you want to do your own thing and people try to discourage you. I don't take very kindly to that. And, but rather than get mad about it, I get the attitude from negative discouragement, like, what do you mean I can't do that? So I came up with this list, and I gave it to her. I printed it out, and I looked at it, and I thought, this just looks awful. But she said, you know, Mom, this is really good, which is high praise, by the way, from a 15-year-old girl. And, uh, sh and I said, well, th oh, that, thanks. I'm glad you like it because it's your birthday present. So, you know, sorry I didn't have a chance to have it bound or anything. And she said, well, no, like, Mom, this is really good. And I said, okay. And she said, like, you should have this published. And I said, well, it was really just meant for you. But she said, no, no, you should publish this. So and I could feel the, the wind pushing on my back and pushing me this way. But when I looked out in front of me, there was just beautiful, the sunset was, was just, the sun was setting. There was no wind in my face. And I was just like, wow. And at that moment, in that time, I got the message. When the world's throwing whatever it can throw at you, just, tur you know what, for that moment, turn your back on everything that's coming at you and just look to the future and just look at all the possibilities. Look at the beauty that's out there. Appreciate everything that's in front of you. Feeling, I'm feeling like I'm winning. As long as you are living, tell me how do you do what you do is so cool. I'm a loser, baby, writing poems, thinking of you at 22. But see, I would not take the chance if I thought it wouldn't. <laughs>